<sighs> Happy Monday, um, I'm Dan from Hippo Crisis Gaming and welcome back to Pokemon White 2 Zombie Challenge. Uh, thank you for joining me for this video. Um, and well, that's where we left off. We just did a section of the cave um, that required Surf and gone gone and gone and got, I've gone and got uh, <laughs> Zoroark back out of the party now. Um, so we're going to go into this cave which is where we were putting off going before because we thought this was the way through but now um, I've got the impression that where I was going instead up the mountain was the way to the next room so this is where I'm going to go now. Uh, hopefully... Oh no I need flash. Right, okay. I'm happy to overwrite a move with Flash, provided that I overwrite a move I own the TM for. Hopefully I own the TM for Flash, otherwise, yeah, I do. Well, <laughs> say otherwise, it's GG. Let's let's see who can learn it. I imagine um, both the the plant types can. I'm going to teach it to Greenleaf. Uh, just because she, cause she's got four of us. Not of the same, but well, actually, <clears throat> I say that, but I, can I relearn any of these? I don't think I can. Let me think. Uh, give up, yep. Yeah. What have I actually got? Let's have a look. Sort them by name. Um, so I've got to get rid of something, I don't have X scissor, I don't have leaf blade or leaf storm or bug bite, so I can't really overwrite any of, um, any of, Um, yeah, any of Micah's moves either. So, it's a case of... I don't know. I mean, am I going to use... They're all really good. Am I going to use... Sorry. Am I going to use... Um... See, so I definitely need to keep Sleep Powder. Am I going to use Giga Drain and Petal Dance and Synthesis? I mean, if Synthesis is like a free... Um, free item, but it doesn't get priority, so maybe it won't go first. Like, I don't have to spend a point to use that. But it needs to be sunny for it to be fully effective. So I'm better off using a potion. I think I'll, I'll get rid of... Synthesis for Flash, just because I want to go in this cave, it's annoying. Um, yet again, being trolled by the game, but <laughs> here we go. I mean, I guess technically I could have taught the Duck Flash if it can learn it, but I don't really want to be carrying the HM Slave around everywhere. Um, if I could have put it away at the other side of that water, I would have done. Um, so I think it's only fair that I sacrifice a move. Um, to do this, so. Watch there be nothing in here as well. So annoying. Okay. Let's switch back to the top screen and get the dousing machine back out. Um, and before I do that, because I just realised I need to, get to use flash, otherwise the whole thing would be pointless. Let's go with flash. Okay. There's an item. PP Max. Okay, that could be cool. Um, hmm. Red Shard. That's adequate. 
Oh no, more water. Crap. Okay, but here's an exit. So maybe this is where I need to go after all that. Dragon Fang, okay. Trainer there, I'll fight him in a moment. Dragon Scale, okay. It's not the same thing as a Dragon Fang, or am I? No, it can't be. Hmm. Veteran Hugo. Now, I want to say this line are bug dragon. They're definitely dragon. So, I'm useless with this, uh, this Pokemon. But let's go with... E Ink Daughter. And then we can use Outrage. Since we don't have any ice moves to my recollection. Awesome. Okay. If it's going to be a dragon again, we'll keep him, keep her out. Uh, it is. It's the dark dragon. Flygon. Uh, ground dragon. See, who needs an all-terrain Venomoth when you have a uh, when you have a crocodile? Really, come on. Awesome. Okay. Yep, I'm a fan of that one. Um, let's run around here. So maybe when I was going up the mountain before, that was actually a that was actually the wrong path. Oh look, Zoroark. Okay. So I don't know how you, if you know how to get past this uh, the Sarawak, or if indeed if indeed you need to, uh, let me know. Might be an after the game thing. Okay. So, do I go and get the duck? I guess I do. Uh, it's really annoying. I wish one. Of, I really wish one of my Pokemon could surf. Uh, let's try up here. But see, I kind of feel like this now is the main way up, and that before, unless unless this is all the same. Oh, it is. Okay, that makes sense now. That does make sense. So I, by go through the cave, it actually meant go through the uh, the water bit. Anyway, let's fight this girl. Yes, I'm sure whatever you just said. Let's fight. Yeah. Alright, it is a trainer, she has a oh, fracture again. Okay, I think we'll go. And we'll get that switch back in, and we're just gonna have to run with the Dragon Slayer. Um, 
the Dragon Slayer who's going to get ahead in levels, but let's just... Uh, it's the post post Nuzlocke version of skills, I think. This this uh, this crocodile, she's uh, she's pretty swish, to put it lightly. Definitely one of my favourite species uh, in the franchise at the moment. I seem to have gone mad for for bug types and ground types recently. I don't know why. Okay, so Vanillux is a ice type. Let's switchy to switchy. Let's switch to. Let's have a switchy poo and let's go with Zoroark. Oh yeah! Got that sweet sweet flamethrower. Which hopefully will see us through some uh, sticky. Ooh. Don't freeze, Zoroark. Thank you. Uh, we'll see us through some trouble sometimes in the Elite Four, but fingers crossed there. In fact, well, I don't know why I'm just crossing my fingers that, I'll, that I'm going to have some sticky times in Elite Four. I'd rather sail through it, but... Uh, so that that must be the area we, we can't get to because of Zoroark, is that right? Or, like, we couldn't... Yeah, there. there okay. That's good. So, whatever is blocking off, normal gem. That re that's really what I've come for. Uh, the gems, if you don't know, are things you can find in any cave. <laughs> they get used once, uh, so if you, if you hold it and use a normal attack, it will boost the power of that normal attack. Um, and you, and then the gem will be gone forever, unless you're doing, um, unless you're doing a, sorry, I'm just switching round, um, let's go with, actually, no, I'll leave Micah up there, I think this guy's gonna have fighting types, um, Oh yeah, I think unless you're in competitive battles, because I'm pretty sure that the items come back after each round on those, uh, but in the normal game. Okay, so we've got the pincers, which is not what I expected. Um, so basically bug v bug, I think, we're, we're, but I'm grass bug, so I'm actually weak to it. Let's go and swap to... Uh, bug, 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 bug. Right, he's going to use fighting moves, so I can't go to Zack or Ink Daughter or Zoroark, so it's going to have to be Savage. The only one not weak to uh, Bug or or to uh, fighting. Let's go with a Psychic, which isn't very effective. I don't know why I did that. No wait, it's not not very effective. It's just not effective, and that's actually a normal attack, and it's actually really strong. And I feel Savage might die now, um, but it's worth ah bugger. I was gonna say it's worth trying because I'm gonna lose a point either way. But anyway, nope, I've I've just taken two off by mistake. Let's give one myself one back. Um. Okay, let's go for Ink Daughter. I'll tell you what I should have done. I should have gone for Zoroark with the flamethrower, but let's uh let's try Earthquake and just see if we can get in there and kill it with a, a high high damage move. No, it's not very effective. Didn't particularly know that, but at least it's hurting itself in confusion. So I can just take it out. It may not have actually known any fighting moves. I don't know. It's all the right. Okay, Heracross is a fighting bug. Um, let's switch. Let's put that switch in. Let's go down to Sorowark and let's use the flamethrower because we know we know that he's that that's good against bugs. So. It removes a bit of the mystique. Um, yeah, see. Makes it so much easier. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, we're going to keep running with five Pokemon um, until we get to the Doctor. Max Elixir. Back to the Doctor, should I say, just because I doubt, although I might be wrong, but I doubt that going down the mountain is going to unveil anything specifically like... My rival's going to be in this cave. Um, there's a ranger. Let's fight that. I might be wrong. I could I could regret that. I could completely uh, regret that decision. We've got two Pokemon, and the first one is Electabuzz, so we're, we're good to stay out with... Uh, Leaf... well... Just because I don't want to get too much experience on the others, I think we'll go with X Scissor. Ooh, paralyze. I'll take the risk here. Um, I know I'll t go second, but let's. Uh, I uh, thunder shouldn't be very effective, so yeah, there we go. So then, got anything on me? Let's. Uh, Pro will pass. That's a. You know, I'm not sure what Pro will pass is. It's, is it like rock? Is it? It could be flying rock. It could be steel. I think I'm pretty sure it's rock. Psychic rock. I'm not sure. Let, let's just keep battling and let's go with a rock move, and just hope we don't get fire like it's got fire flamethrower or something in before flamethrower. I oh, know power gem. That is super effective, apparently. Crappy dude. Okay, let's set that point back off. Okay, let's go for green leaf. I shouldn't risk that sort of paralyzed second second turning thing. Let's go with a petal dance. And we're paralyzed again. Curses. Well, we're stuck in a petal dance now, so nothing I can do. Fuse, but we've won. Okay, so we do need to get back to <laughs> to that healer as much as we can, or uh, back obviously to um, back to the Pokemon Center because we we want to get the duck out anyway. Okay, so that's good. We've done this loop. So the doctor is just nearby. But I will go, I'll heal on the Doctor, but then I will go back to, uh... Ooh, Dark Gem. And that's exactly how you find a normal gem normally. That was slightly dangerous, because I could have accidentally fought an Exa Drill. And uh, the last time I did that, or the last time I remember doing that, is when uh, Skills died on the <laughs> on the Nuzlocke. Which is pretty much where I I claim that the, uh, the, the whole tide of battle changed. So, quickly, quickly, let's run back down and get get back to the Pokemon Center. I'm sure running around this would be quicker than cutting it just because of this stupid animation, but uh... nah. I always hallways. I always do that. I always drop down into the um into the area where you can't actually get out, but there we go. Do it again. Whoop. Okay. So I'm just gonna go into the PC and get the duck out, and then go and we'll go and surf and do the uh, what is likely to be a hidden item or something. Uh, so I'll put. Um, I'll swap out for party Pokemon. Swap Zoroark out again just because, as I've said before, he gets double, or she gets double XP because she belonged to N in the first place. Uh, so if anybody's, n if anybody can afford to fall behind, it's her. She does have that fire move, so 
it's GG if uh, we need it, but uh, you know, we do what we can. It's, it's so annoying of all the Pokemon that I had that could have learned Surf, and I didn't pick any of them out. But uh, that's the look of the draw, and uh, thankfully you guys said I could Surf, so... At least, uh, it might be messing around, but at least I get to do get to explore those areas. And then, next episode, we can uh, creep up the mountain and see if uh, how much of Victory Road is left. I'm not sure. I feel like I've done quite a lot of exploring around this area, so... Right, okay, so we have to use Flash again, just because we taught a Pokémon Flash, and this is probably the only place in the game that's dark, so... <laughs> Just to humour myself, I'm going to use it again, even though I don't think I need it anymore. Um, okay, let's surf. Quack. Okay, is it just to get this item? Literally? Is it on this ledge? Where's the... Uh, oh, it's going to use surf. Uh, I'm standing on it. And it was a max elixir. I guess, I mean... That's not really to be sniffed out because I'm going to need that between Elite Four battles. And here's another item. Here is a rare candy. Which, uh, I, yeah, that's that's actually quite good. I don't know if it's getting rid of synthesis good, but probably is. <laughs> Just because I'm not sure. Oh. Damn it! Oh, well, anyway. Um... I'm going to sort myself out and get back to the uh, the mountaintop and swap my team back to normal. Uh, thank you very, very much for watching. And if you have enjoyed this episode, please give me a like. Um, and if you're not subscribed already and you want to keep up with this series and my others, you can click the subscribe button below, uh, either below the, the face cam or below the video, depending on your device and whether I've linked up the annotations yet. But yes, thank you very much for watching. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. I thought I'd said the wrong word then. Uh, clearly, I <laughs> I've gone insane again. But yeah, thanks, thanks, guys. Seriously, I do appreciate all of your comments and likes. And um, I will see you soon for more zombie challenge. Thank you again, and again, and again, and again, and again, and again. Goodbye.